What's up guys and welcome to the show. Sorry for about the lateness uh, of this video. It's kind of a crazy day. I was pretty sick and stuff like that. But uh, sorry about the lighting too. But this is, uh, I know I did a review video on my shoes, DC shoes, about a month ago. This is the 30 day, one month uh, update review on the shoes. Basically how these DC skate shoes held up after heavy use for 30 days now i've skateboarded with these virtually every single day like i said my main mode of transportation lately is the skateboard is the longboards uh, electronic skateboards that whole thing uh, so these have been heavily used every day for the last 30 days and how they've held up so so far uh, they've held up actually really well they form to my foot now so when I put my foot in there, the soles are actually formed to my heel, the arch in my foot, the, the toes in the front, they're all formed to it. You still got that cushioning around, so when you put in your foot in, it still feels like you got that tight cushion around it, which is really good, uh, especially uh, after that amount of use. Uh, the soles are not worn down. I don't know if you could tell kind of a bad angle in lighting, but the soles aren't, aren't worn down uh, as much at all. Yes, I know they are pretty dirty. I did uh, some longboarding today, grabbed some stuff in the rain. So they're pretty wet right now. Uh, I definitely got to clean them up, uh, which I'll probably end up doing that tomorrow before I use them. Um, but yeah, all in all, they still, they held up really well through doing tricks like kick flips, ollies, uh, that whole thing. As you can tell, hopefully that's focused. There's no scraping on, usually you get tear by your foot kicking up and you get that scrape. There's none of that on these shoes, just dirt. Um, the, the, this area, like I said, is all like a hard rubber. So it protects the shoe really, really well. So you don't get uh, that tear on the cloth type shoe like the other shoes usually you do. These you don't, uh, shoelaces haven't torn on me yet, which happens on regular usual shoes quite a bit. Uh, that's just a knot in one of the shoes or uh, laces. You haven't gotten the laces tear, which does, like I said, happen quite a bit. The tongues are still really good, still full, still thick. Uh, so all in all, these shoes have held up really, really great for the past 30 days of heavy everyday use. Now, unlike other shoes, uh, like I said, I've had, you name it, I've had types of skate shoes. Nikes, I had <clears throat> two pairs. One of my Nikes didn't even last me like half a year my other pair didn't even make me uh make it a full year uh i had just tons of different types of skate shoes that haven't really lasted me these ones uh so far in the past 30 days held up really well with no wear at all the soles are formed to the feet but the cushioning hasn't worn down or anything like that they don't hurt your feet or anything when you're trying to sk skate so all in all the 30 day review with these things are really phenomenal i definitely cannot recommend this shoe enough give it a perfect 10 out of 10 uh so yeah definitely check out the dc uh skate shoes because you definitely cannot go wrong but anyway that's it for the video guys you know i love you very much don't forget to like comment subscribe and i'll check you in the next video